Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today we're tackling a question that many Keras users encounter when working with TensorFlow. Our viewer is curious about how to accurately determine the real amount of GPU memory being used by their network architecture. They mentioned that simply checking NVIDIA Dash SME isn't enough, as TensorFlow tends to allocate all available memory, leaving them in the dark about actual usage. So how can we uncover the true GPU memory consumption? Let's dive in. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we'll be going through your questions, answering them, and hopefully finding that solution you need. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy, just like me, and hopefully you'll find that solution you're looking for. Now, let's continue on to the video. To understand the real GPU memory usage when using Keras with TensorFlow, we need to first configure TensorFlow to allow growth of the GPU memory allocation. Next, we can monitor the GPU memory usage more accurately by using TensorFlow's built-in functions. This will help us track the memory consumed by our model during training. Additionally, you can use the TensorFlow Profiler to get detailed insights into memory usage. This tool provides a comprehensive view of how much memory each operation is using. Finally, if you want to see real-time memory usage, consider using third-party tools like GPUtil or NVIDIA SMI with specific flags to monitor memory consumption during training. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To manage GPU memory usage in Keras, you can configure TensorFlow to allow memory growth instead of reserving all memory at once. This way, you can monitor the actual memory usage with NVIDIA SMI. I hope that's found the resolution that you're looking for and you managed to work your way through your issue. Please, if it did help, hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until the next technical time you need help, have a good one.